Think you know how old your car battery is exactly? Well then, you might be in for a surprise. Because every vehicle battery has a date code on it. But it may be older than it appears. When replacing your car battery, it's nice to know when it was actually made. That way you know it hasn't been sitting on the shelf for a long time degrading. Before purchasing a new battery, or a used car for that matter, I always check the date on the battery so I know how old it is and when I should be thinking of replacing it. However, the date of the battery might not really be the date it was produced, as I will soon explain, and why I made this video to alert other buyers about this. There is one exception to this, and that is when the vehicle is brand new. So in this GM vehicle battery you see, this one has no date on it and just has a black label. When you see this, then you can interpret this label as the original battery for the vehicle and that this was put in when the vehicle was actually manufactured. Now again, that's just for the original, but for any replacement batteries after the original, it's a completely different story when battery manufacturers must put a date of sorts on the battery. Now I'll be talking about AC Delco specifically on how they go about dating their batteries so you can better understand how to read these battery codes and their specific battery coding style. I made a separate detailed video about how to read this battery date as well as how to test it and install it in a Cadillac vehicle. Those can be watched later and I'll put those in the description. But I'll quickly explain that this sticker here is where the battery information is provided and specifically is where you can read the date. AC Delco's battery decoder format can be read as the following. The first letter is for the battery make, which is not important in this case, but the first two digits indicate the month and the third digit indicates the year of the battery. The last character indicates where the battery was specifically manufactured at a plant. And these engraved letters and numbers represent the serial number of the battery casing, which indicates which batch it was part of when it was shipped on its pallet. So not important in this case. Again, the main thing to know here are the three digits above, indicating the month and the year. So now that you know how to decode AC Delco's battery date code, now you need to know <laughs> that this date code provided doesn't mean the sticker is the actual date of production. I know this sounds confusing, but I'll continue. This pre-label sticker you see is really meant for warranty purposes. And to be transparent, AC Delco on their website even calls this a warranty date code, not plainly a date of actual production of the battery. Anyway, I went into a store to buy a brand new AC Delco 12 volt lead acid battery, and I wanted to get a battery with the latest date possible. So I found a battery, but the day I bought the battery was January 22nd, 2023. But the battery day code says 043, which means April 2023. So how was that possible when it was January 22nd, 2023 at the time? which would be almost three months earlier. I was quite skeptical and would reach out to AC Delco for an explanation. During my conversation, I was told that the sticker placed on the label is pre-made and pre-dated from Korea and then slapped onto the battery with a future date as they make these batteries in batches. They intentionally future code these by a few months ahead. And I was also told that they do this for the benefit of warranty if you don't have a receipt then if there's a problem with the battery then the date will be used again this is for warranty purposes and can be good or bad depending on when you got the battery i see this warranty code differently again i was told the battery is made two to three months ahead of time but it really appears to be about four to six months ahead of time again i bought a battery in january even though the label says April, this battery had to be made much sooner as it would have had been on a boat from Korea a month prior. And that doesn't account for how long this was in storage, waiting to be shipped to not just the States, but to my local store. Therefore, this battery is about as much as six months old than the label date printed. So why do they do this? I was told they make the batteries in batches and they code them out a few months ahead of time as it takes time for the retailer 
to get the battery and then distribute it to its final store location for a purchase. So while I understand that point of view, well, I think it's also for marketing purposes. Think of it from this point of view. When you buy food, like bread, they push out the old food first and then give you the new food. So sometimes you might take produce that's not in front, but from behind. Why? Because you know it has a later date and might last longer. That doesn't mean the older food is worse, right? Well, the batteries are kind of the same way. Also, when you buy a battery and it has a date of that month, for example, you feel pretty good knowing you got a fresh battery, right? Now, my personal view is batteries last way longer nowadays than they used to and are great. And if a battery goes out, it's usually due to user faults such as leaving on a light or having some other kind of battery drain issue, like from an aftermarket radio or headlights. So then you would just put on a trickle charger or jump starter to, to revive it and you're good. All my vehicle batteries have lasted over four years. And heck, you can even revive a bad battery nowadays without buying a new one at the store. I have a separate video that shows that. I should mention I'm only referring to lead acid batteries and not lithium ion batteries found mostly in electric cars as a pouch style or cylindrical cell like Tesla's. Time will tell how long those type of batteries truly last between all OEMs, not just Tesla's. Anyway, with that being said, I'm quite curious to hear what others think about these day code stickers, not just from AC Delco, but other battery manufacturers. Do you care about the battery date if it's off by a few months? Also, how long do your batteries last? Please let us all know and mention your thoughts in the comments. As mentioned earlier, if you want to see how to test these kinds of batteries or how to install it in your vehicle, then you can check them out. It's in the description. If you found this video to be interesting, then please hit the like button and subscribe for other cool videos. And I'll see you next time. Have a great day or night.